Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back. You are watching Furutech. Last time we created a video on the Oxonus 12.1c07 update, and that time we discussed the major bug and suggested to don't upgrade to the c07. To check that out, you can watch the video from the right side I card. But finally, OnePlus released the hotfix update for that bug in the form of Oxonus 12.1c08. So updates on updates are releasing by the OnePlus, but there is some confusions are going on everyone's mind and me too that we are going to discuss in this video. So now without further ado, let's get started. On a new adventure. As I am on the Oxonus 12C05 from the last two weeks, last time even at the release of C06, I upgraded to the C06, but later I downgraded to the C05, but from that time what happened, I don't know. I did not got any update nor C06, not C07 or C08. I got some users who are facing same issues, they did not got any of these updates. So what is the phase manner update system of OnePlus I did not understood until now. They released the C06 and tell it will be available in the phase manner to the users, but before getting the old update, new update was ready to be released. I think their OT update system is also in the confusion which update should be released to the users if there are 3 updates are already available. When the C06 was available, there was a official post by OnePlus at Orbit community. But as we discussed in the last video, some users reported that they got C07 instead of C06. And the C07 has the major bug of Bluetooth, but some users also reported that the heavy battery drain issue on the C07. On the 7th of August, OnePlus released the official post of releasing Oxonus 12C07 incremental update. As per the changelog in a thread, they mentioned that they improved the system stability and optimized the experience of fingerprint unlocking. But now because of that Bluetooth issue, OnePlus released the hotfix incremental update of Oxonus 12C08 update which has clearly mentioned that this update is mainly optimizes the Bluetooth stability. In other words, it fixed the Bluetooth bug. As per the system stability, they may be fixed that heavy battery drain. But one bug of 4K ultra steady mode is still not got fixed. While shooting ultra steady mode in a 4K resolution, it still switches back to the 180p resolution. There is no rollback package available for this update, but you can try out the old downgrade package to downgrade your device from the C08 to Oxonos 11. But I can't guarantee it will work. Both the Indians and European people got this update. But the unlucky people like me still complaining where is the update who didn't got any update of C06, C07 and the C08. Every morning we wake up and check the OTS still we didn't get anything and the new post images saying that the new incremental update pushed by the OnePlus. What a jokes are going on I can't understand OnePlus has to seriously look into these issues and release the update with the proper testing so there will be no need of hotfix updates again and again. So that's it for today guys if you think I help you then please do like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon for the notification of upcoming content. Thanks for watching see you next time take care bye bye.